Hey guys, it's Mel here from Lose Weight Look Fab. Um, today I've got a lovely little uh, Chinese style carriage to share with you. Um, so to start with, I'm just going to turn on the heat, just spray a little oil into a large saucepan. And then what I'm going to do, um, I've got an onion here. I'm just going to cut that in half and just chop that up. So just finely diced your onion. half finely chopped onion to the saucepan and you just want to just let that fry down just for a couple of minutes. Okay so while the onion's cooking down um, you need to have a cauliflower, um, just a normal size one and you just want to chop that, just remove the main stalk and you just want to chop that into chunky pieces just like that. To the onion, just add two tablespoons of curry powder, two of these stock pots, and just a little water. Just give that a good stir and just let that cook down for about two, three minutes. Okay, so add the cauliflower that you've just chopped up, and this makes it a perfect meal um, if you're following the new Slim and Well SP plan. Um, it's full of speed food and protein so just add the cauliflower and then you just want to cover that with enough water um, and let that boil well, bring it to a boil and then we're just going to turn the heat down and let that simmer until the cauliflower is um, softened okay so while that's um, coming to a boil I'm just going to take the other half of onion and what you want to do is just chop that just roughly just like that quarter 150 grams of mushrooms just want to spray another saucepan with a little cooking spray and let that heat up okay. add those onions and just let them just soften down slightly just for a couple of minutes to that um, I'm adding uh, 400 grams of cooked from frozen chicken breast um, the reason I'm using frozen cooked from frozen chicken is that I just find that it's much more succulent the end result is uh, you know tender chicken better than using uh, fresh stuff so um, yeah so that goes in give that a stir and just let that cook down again for a couple of minutes stirring um, so that it doesn't stick okay so after about 10 minutes with the chicken cooking down you just want to add those mushrooms in give it a good stir and again just let it cook down for a further so five ten minutes or so the cauliflower is all cooked down nicely so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a hand blender in there I'm just going to blend that until it's smooth okay so that's your curry sauce all done you can actually freeze this it freezes well just make sure you defrost it well um, when you're reheating it um, so the curry sauce is done what I'm going to do now is that the chicken and the mushrooms that we were cooking down earlier I'm just going to add that to the sauce and then let that heat through um, I'm going to add some frozen peas. So a tin of mushy peas. Don't let this put you off. Um, I'm not a fan of mushy peas, but I can honestly say that you don't actually taste them in there. Um, give that a good mix through. And then you're just going to let that cook down until the chicken um, is completely cooked all the way through. Okay, so that's my version of um, a, a Chinese uh, curry. Um, perfect for um, the SP um, EE days on Slimming World. Hope you enjoy the recipe and don't forget to like and share. Thanks for watching.